getting statistics on your site. Before getting deep into specifics about plugins and settings, I want to talk about something that's very important to doing business online. You may choose to use a WordPress plugin to implement this, and so this is a very good time to talk to you about analytics. Analytics programs give you statistics about your website activity. The best way to install an analytics program will be to look for a WordPress plugin that uses the free Google Analytics online tool to add to your website. To find this plugin, all you need to do is go to Google itself, type in Google Analytics WP plugin, and then look for the results. Download the plugin and install it to your website. You'll be required to start a free Google Analytics account in order to complete the installation. Once Google has verified that Analytics is on your site, you'll be ready to start analyzing statistics about who's coming to your site and what they're doing. So why is Analytics important? Google Analytics tells you most of what you'll need to know about your site visitors. With the information you're given, you'll be able to make adjustments so that once customers begin to arrive at your site, you can guide them to see your products and services so that they can buy them. If for some reason your customers are coming to your site and getting stuck on a page that does not put them in the position to buy, you'll want to know that. If your customers are coming to your site and leaving very quickly, you'll want to know that also. Google Analytics will tell you who visits your site, how long they stay, which pages they access, who sent them, and when they visit. All of this is very important information that you'll be able to use to improve on the activity on your site. Analytics will tell you if your content is interesting. The other important factor is that it will tell you whether or not people are interested in your content. The more interested that people are in your content, the more they're likely to share on social media and the more likely they are to stay and read. As part of its algorithm, Google has taken into consideration how long a person stays on your site, as well as how many or how much they share your information with their friends. If your content doesn't interest people and they're quickly leaving, use your analytics program to help you to develop better content and to continue to improve on it until you get the results that will help you to get better rankings you want, as well as to influence more people to buy. Another important aspect of Google Analytics is it will tell you what mobile users are doing. As you know, an increasing number of searchers are using their mobile devices to access the Internet. You want to make sure that these mobile users find your site enjoyable and acceptable. Use Google Analytics to monitor this and make adjustments so that this increasing number of people will want to visit your site. Analytics will also give you good information to share with advertisers. When they approach you about wanting to put their ad on your site, you can use your analytics information to share with them. You'll be sharing real information that will help them to make a good decision about whether or not your site is worth their time. Also, once you have an analytics program, you can then begin to set realistic goals for your site and then work on them until you accomplish them. For example, you may want to set a goal of a certain number of site visitors by a certain period of time. Your analytics program will tell you how you're progressing and will give you clues on what you can do to increase that traffic until it reaches what you want it to.